ever pondered over the possibility of making your family's life happier than it is now? This is a question that may lead us down multiple paths, but today we are exploring one less trodden. We're delving into the realm of geopolitics, economics and ancient philosophy. A peculiar combination, you might think, but bear with me. Our world, each region with its unique latitude, longitude and environmental resources, is a complex system of interrelationships. The United States, for example, effectively uses economic sanctions and the global financial system, particularly through the dollar's dominance and the swift banking network as tools of foreign policy. Yet the potential repercussions of such actions are immense and far-reaching. Now let's turn back the hands of time. Picture the Yi Jing, the Book of Changes, an ancient Chinese divination text, and one of the oldest Chinese classics. It emphasizes the cyclical nature of change, the dynamics between prosperity and decline, and the moral and ethical considerations guiding actions and decisions. At first glance, it may seem out of place in our modern world. Yet it may hold the key to understanding the transient nature of power and influence and the inevitable flow between states of being. In the realm of geopolitics, the use of power and influence is strategic. Economic power is used to control global politics and enforce foreign policy objectives, yet this could lead to backlash and the decline of dollar dominance. The Yi Jing, on the other hand, teaches us that power and influence are transient and must be wielded with wisdom and restraint. The perception of prosperity and decline is also crucial. A strategic pivot away from dollar dependency could undermine its status, reflecting a broader theme of rise and fall influenced by strategic decisions. However, the Yi Jing advises caution and humility in times of power, emphasizing the inevitability of change. Modern analysis relies on factual reporting and economic data to understand and predict the outcomes of policy decisions. The Yi Jing, in contrast, uses metaphysical concepts and divination to offer guidance, focusing on understanding the underlying dynamics and ethical considerations of actions. It interprets natural phenomena and human behaviors through symbolic language, offering a reflective, introspective approach to understanding change and decision-making. Strategic foresight, diversification and ethical consideration are essential in global finance strategies. Understanding the cycles of change and the moral implications of one's actions can inform more sustainable, holistic management practices. The modern narrative raises questions about the morality of using economic power for geopolitical aims and the long-term sustainability of such strategies. However, the Yi Jing emphasizes the importance of ethical leadership and the impact of moral considerations on the prosperity and stability of societies suggesting that true strength lies in virtuous conduct and wise decision-making. In conclusion, making connections between modern geopolitical analysis and specific hexagrams in the I Ching requires an approach that intertwines contemporary issues with ancient symbolism and philosophy. It's a journey that opens up new perspectives and offers valuable insights into our interconnected world. So next time you ponder over making your family's life happier, remember, the answers may be found not just in the world of today, but also in the wisdom of the past. Have you ever pondered how ancient wisdom could illuminate the path to a more prosperous future? Have you ever contemplated the enduring relevance of age-old teachings in our modern, complex world? The Yi Jing, an ancient Chinese divination text holds the answers to these questions and more. The Yi Jing is among the oldest of the Chinese classics, a testament to enduring wisdom that transcends time. It aligns with the teachings found in the Gospel of John, which states that the Tao was with God in the beginning, and the Tao was God. This ancient Eastern wisdom encapsulated in the Yi Jing shares mutual objectives with this tenet, both seeking to illuminate the path to wisdom. In a world where geopolitical events and economic outcomes increasingly intertwine, the insights offered by the Yi Jing are more relevant than ever. As we traverse through these tumultuous times, marked by conflict and economic instability, 
the foresight provided by such timeless texts can guide us towards understanding and thriving amidst chaos. Our channel, Storm Geopolitics and Humani, has been at the forefront of decoding these complex scenarios. In October of the previous year, our analysis predicted escalating tensions between Israel and Hamas that would disrupt the Gaza region. This prediction, rooted in the wisdom of the I Ching, underscored the importance of trust, inclusivity and sustainable coexistence. More recently, disturbances in the Red Sea triggered by Houthi militants from Yemen have highlighted the vulnerability of key trade routes such as Egypt's Suez Canal. Our channel accurately predicted this disruption, which has led to a notable increase in shipping costs, impacting global supply chains and inflating import costs for OECD members by 5 percentage points. This event, known as the Red Sea Dilemma, exemplifies the intricate connections between geopolitical events and economic outcomes. The Wei Jigua from the I Ching teaches us that crisis also embodies opportunity, a theme explored in our videos, an ethical fallacy and chilly crosswinds. Celestial Metaphors, another of our videos, accurately predicted the recent earthquake in Japan and the North Korean missile threat facing the United States. It also forecasted the Bank of Japan's departure from its negative interest rate policy as early as March. This shift will lead to multiple interest rate hikes this year, resulting in an even more bearish outlook for Japanese government bonds. As we look towards the future, it's clear that our actions today will shape the world of tomorrow. By understanding the underlying dynamics of such crises, investors can make informed decisions that not only seek profit, but also contribute to a more stable and sustainable global economy. This is the wisdom of the Yi Jing, a guiding light in a world of constant change. Have you ever considered how ancient wisdom might guide modern investment strategies? Imagine drawing upon the timeless principles of Yi Jing, an ancient Chinese text, also known as the Book of Changes, to navigate the financial markets. The Yi Jing offers a unique perspective on change, potential and balance, elements that resonate strongly with the dynamics of investing. The Yi Jing is centered around 64 hexagrams, each representing a unique state of change in the universe. Consider the Pi hexagram, which signifies a state of closure or obstruction. In the context of investment, it advises caution and reflection during uncertain times, a principle that finds relevance in the current economic landscape marked by potential shifts in monetary policy and inflationary pressures. The Yi Jing also teaches that within stagnation lies the potential for growth. It invites investors to consider adaptable and resilient strategies. This could involve diversification of portfolios to include a mix of assets that could benefit from both an expanding economy and protective measures against inflation. It could also mean prioritizing investments in companies with strong fundamentals in the manufacturing and services sectors. Patience, as counseled by the Pi hexagram, can be a virtue for investors. Avoid hasty decisions based on minor currency fluctuations and focus on long-term trends and fundamentals. Like the Yi Jing emphasizes balance and the eventual movement towards harmony, diversify investments to balance risks and seek opportunities in currencies that may be poised for recovery or growth. Understanding the transient nature of PI suggests that stagnation is only temporary. As investors, staying adaptable, ready to shift strategies in response to early signs of market movement, or shifts in economic indicators can be beneficial. Just as interpreting Pi requires context, analyzing currency movements also requires understanding the geopolitical, economic and social factors that might influence currency values. In times of uncertainty, akin to the Pi state, engaging selectively in markets showing signs of positive divergence can offer safer havens or more promising growth prospects. 
The principles of Yi Jing offer a unique lens to view and navigate the financial markets. Embracing patience during uncertain times, seeking balance in investments, adapting to change, understanding the broader context, and engaging selectively are strategies that resonate with the wisdom of Yi Jing. Remember, like the Earth has its own unique longitude and latitude, and its unique environmental resources, each investment opportunity is unique, influenced by a multitude of factors. Be open to continuous learning and improvement in practice. Thank you for your time and attention. If you found value in today's exploration of Yi Jing principles and their application to investment strategies, don't forget to show your support. The journey of learning and growth continues.